All right, so I want to show you how I got this uh, theme. It's not just a theme, um, it includes changing the explorer, which is risky, um, but if anything happens, then you should make backups, which is what I've done. Um, I'll show you later in the video. So I was just looking around on uh, DeviantArt, and I found this. It's a beta. This is what it's going to look like if you change everything. Um, I don't know how to change uh, the icons yet. Uh, but hopefully you should point that out more in the future. So here's a download. Uh, 7 megabytes. Okay, so this is what is in the package. Uh, you have a read me here, but um, I've done this twice and I kind of know everything by heart. Now what you have to do is um, patch, use un universal theme patcher, um, choose which version of your OS you have, x86 means 32 bit, so You'd patch this and then you'd have to restart. But if you've already done this, then you won't need to uh, do it again, I think. But run it anyway, otherwise it won't work. And then after that, you get uh, these folders and themes. You would cut them and paste them into uh, C, Windows, uh, Resources themes and pa uh, paste them in here and uh, double click when I'm I don't know what op opaque maximize I don't know what that the difference between those are uh, and they, they will appear in your personalized window now the risky bit which is optional which makes this look the same and I'll show you how to get the uh, quick launch in a minute you need to go to uh, in the package, where the fuck is it? Um, again, it says make backups. Um, so this is the 32 bit, the 64, uh, 64 bit EXEs in here. You cut them and paste them into C Windows, scroll down. Now, whatever your current um, one that's, that's called Explore, right click it. Um, well, for example, it would be this one. Go to properties, security, advanced, and then owner, edit, and then make it your uh, your account, your administrative account. This uh, every uh, thing in this you have to have administrative uh, rights to do. So make it your administrator, and then or your account, and then if it's the, all, not all of the permissions are allowed then tick them all click OK and then rename it to explorer dot back just like that and then paste a new explorer in there and then what you could do I think is you could um, first of all apply the theme and then I think you could like either end the explorer and then open it up again or you could do what I did and then just log out and log back in and it should look like this. Um, there are extra things in the package. If you look at the README you can get the Vista sidebar but this didn't work with the uh, Norton gadget so I, I just thought fuck it. And uh, it didn't uh, font smooth like the menu and it didn't it didn't exactly work well. It didn't work at first. Um, I don't know how to change the icons so don't ask me that either. Almost forgot to show you how to get the uh, quick launch, right? So what you have to do first of all is right click on your taskbar, click um, unlock it basically. Uh, go to toolbars and new toolbar and you have to go to app data, just type that in. And then local, I think, no it actually isn't. 
um, scroll down to Microsoft and then Internet Explorer and then click launch and then you click select folder and you uh, will be over here you just have to right click it and select uh, we'll right click where it says quick launch and then don't show text and don't show title and then move it along here uh, yeah that's it so uh, again thanks for watching please check out my other videos tell me if this worked or not and uh, yeah rate right. lol